We have just produced the latest in our series of reports looking ahead to the world in 2050. This includes economic growth projections for 32 of the largest economies in the world. So what are the key trends we expect to see by the middle of the century? Five things stand out. First, we expect a return to the dominant role of Asia in the world economy. We think China will overtake the US before 2030 in terms of the value of its output in dollar terms. India, if it can sustain its progress on economic reforms, could by 2050 also be catching up rapidly with the US and the EU. Europe will have to up its game to avoid becoming a bystander to this historic shift in global economic power. Second, however, we are likely to see Chinese growth decelerate markedly after 2020, as its population ages and its investment boom runs out of steam. Growth in India should hold up better, but this will depend on continued progress in strengthening the political, legal and economic institutions that provide the foundations of long-term sustainable growth. Third, our updated escape index shows that other emerging economies like Indonesia, Mexico, Turkey, Brazil, South Africa and Nigeria, while having great potential, also still have a long way to go to get their institutions up to the standards of world leaders like Sweden and Singapore. Fourth, those emerging economies that currently rely heavily on oil and gas, such as Russia, Nigeria and the Middle East, may face longer term problems unless they can successfully diversify their economies over the coming decades. Finally, Western businesses should not neglect their home markets in North America and Europe. Even if these are growing at relatively slow rates, average income levels per person will still be significantly higher in 2050 in economies like the US and the UK than in emerging giants like China and India. I hope that whets your appetite, but please read our new report for more details of how we think the world economy will look in 2050.